So this looks like the color of the on tour that we'll be uh, getting. This is blonde canvas. Yeah. With with the graphite ultra leather upholstery. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And the carbon concrete uh, aggregate countertops for the Corian countertops. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think that's the color combo. So that's how yeah. it's gonna come, huh? Well, it's a it's a nice uh, contrast, you know, with the light cabinets, uh, mm -hmm. dark countertop, dark uh, uh, darker upholstery. It's a it's a very nice combination, and it's a nice contrast as well. Hello, we are Tavan and David. This is our journey in finding the, the RV, RV for us. The goal of this channel is to share our journey with you. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and click the notification bell. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> and? and what's it gonna be? What's it gonna be? It's gonna be on tour 2.0. 2. 2. Oh. On tour 2.0. Yeah. yeah. Hi Doug. Hi Doug. Hello Javon and David, how are you? Good, good, good. how are good, you? Good, good, good. Good to God, God, It's a little bit of a dreary, wet day in Saskatoon here today at the factory. Oh, wow. Wait, can you introduce yourself first? Sure, absolutely. Okay. Yeah. Uh, my name's Doug McCashew. I am a factory representative for Pleasure Way Motorhomes. Uh, I'm based out of Saskatoon, Saskatchewan at the factory. My territory that I cover or for my dealer territory is the Midwest U.S. to the Eastern Seaboard from uh, New Hampshire down to uh, Jacksonville, Florida, actually Leesburg, Florida. So uh, that is my position here. The changes that we make for the on tour are, are, are minimal. We, we change the countertop, of course, to the squared off water wall edge, and mm -hmm. giving it a more contemporary modern look. And we've added the 10 inch screens to the on tours as well. Um, other than that, that's those are the two changes we've made to uh, the Ford based to the transit chassis models the on tour 2.0 and the 2.2. Um, we already have the Vario ducted heat furnace in it already. But uh, again, those are the two changes that we made to the contour. Okay. Uh, for you right now, if you okay, want to sure. go inside a, a 2.0, I just have to do the flip here. Okay. There we go. Oh, okay, that. Okay, yeah. There's my crystal ball, so I'll just use the crystal ball here to see when you're using this. <laughs> yeah. Um, it's it's going to be late. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. <laughs> nice, yeah. All right. Now, which, which one are you in? You in? Uh, a 2021 and a half, uh, 2.0. I'm just going to walk up front here quickly. Okay, so here's your, your cockpit of your 2020 Ford chassis. So we'll start with transit chassis. So we'll start there. You can see that the screen is the 8 inch screen is on navigation right now. Mm -hmm. uh, it's very user friendly. Again, uh, the cockpit experience in the, in the Ford Transit is, is quite comfortable. It's a very nice driving units, uh, you know, all the arm positions are nice uh, ergonomically placed. Um, again, uh, lots of 12-volt uh, plug-ins and USB plug-ins and, and storage space. Uh, you know, there's just a little bit of storage space above the cockpit area as well. Again, your front seats are covered in ultra-leather, and it's black ultra-leather. We do that. We use black for all of our models. Mm -hmm. Because most of the time the front trim is all black and gray, anyways. So, um, so you can see the the new waterfall edge, and we squared off the cabinets to accommodate that new 10 inch screen, which you see uh, just below the lip of that uh, uh, that countertop. So you can see that we have uh, squared off the countertop, given a little bit of a waterfall edge again, and uh, all the way around. You can see that, and again, it just it just gives it a nice. Uh, contemporary modern look, uh, we feel. And again, there's your 10 inch, new 10 inch screen. You'll have mm. one in the front, uh, when, uh, near the sliding opening or the sliding door, and one in the rear above the, the, the television. They both function exactly the same. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah. And then the cover for the sink, 
Duh, that's different than before. before. It is, it's a slotted sink uh, yep. top, so if yep. you want to do place on that if you'd like to let them dry. And again, there's your sink, uh, here's your induction cooktop. Uh-huh. And your big stainless steel sink as well. Yeah. And I'll just get that out of there first, there we go. Yeah. And there's, there's your, your large stainless steel sink. Mm. Nice. Very nice. So there's your compressor refrigerator. It has a small freezer on top, as you can see. Mm -hmm. uh, we have drawers underneath the refrigerator for mm -hmm. some, some storage. So we have two drawers underneath the refrigerator. Mm -hmm. uh, we have a cabinet that we've added above the galley as well. Mm -hmm. And then your upper cabinets mm -hmm. in the rear. Nice. Yep. And you also have your hanging closet. Mm -hmm. So inside that hanging closet, or uh, your bed boards are stored in there, so you can uh, extend your bed down and make it into a full queen size bed if you want, using the backrests, or you can use it as two twin beds if you'd like. Right. Yeah. So you're going to place those boards right there. There's mm -hmm. some plates just right here underneath mm -hmm. these cushions, so those boards will, will fill that in. And then you're going to use the back rests from the ottomans to fill that to give yourself a full queen size bed. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Right. So this looks like the color of the on-tour that we'll be uh, getting. This is blonde cabinets yeah. with, with the graphite ultra leather upholstery yep. mm -hmm. and the carbon concrete uh, aggregate countertops for the Korean countertops. Mm -hmm. yep. I think that's the color combo. So that's how it's going to come, huh? Well, it's a, it's a nice uh, contrast, you know, with the light cabinets, uh, mm -hmm. dark countertop, dark, uh, uh, darker upholstery. It's a, it's a very nice combination and it's a nice contrast as well. Yep. Right, right. And then the bathroom? Bathroom is, I'll just quickly turn the lights on. Mm -hmm. Let's see if I can pan back and give you a mm -hmm. better look at it. So there's your bathroom. Again, we, do, we don't have a sink in the bathroom of the 2.0. Mm -hmm. uh, obviously, we have it in the 2.2. It has a full vanity in it with a sink in it. Uh, but we're limited in space for the 2.0 bathrooms. Mm -hmm. uh, so we decided to eliminate the corner sink and just give you that much more room inside there. Right. Yep. Ah. Okay, so that was a very nice walk. That was great. Through to give us an idea. Okay. Uh, can you go over um, the um, onto chassis, the Ford chassis, compared to sure. last year? What's yeah. new? What are the new features? Go ahead. Yeah. Sure. Okay, so the changes that have been made for from 2019 to the 2024 transit chassis. Mm -hmm. Uh, the most significant changes are in the safety features. They've kind of caught up now with Mercedes Benz when it comes to safety features with adaptive cruise control, uh, emergency braking, lane keeping assist, and blind spot assist. Um, some other changes that they've made, they've gone with uh, a 10 speed transmission that comes with the, the 3.5 EcoBoost boost engine, of course, uh, which is extremely powerful, lots of torque. Uh, they've also changed out the head units. Uh, navigation media screen uh, from a five inch screen to an eight inch screen and uh, uh, it certainly makes a big difference as a matter of fact it's very user friendly uh, it's the Ford Sync 3 system uh, it does have Wi-Fi connect to it as well Wi-Fi hotspot connect to it as well um, the front seats will now swivel so both passenger and driver seats will now swivel in mm. the 2020 chassis very nice. nice very nice so so would you say um, the Ford chassis now have pretty much the same thing that the uh, the Mercedes has on the well, SN or no? Right, this has a few more uh, bells and whistles when it comes to safety features, but mm -hmm. the Lake Ford is, is, has certainly upgraded their, uh, their the transit for 2020 to, mm -hmm. to seriously catch up to, to Mercedes Benz when it comes to safety. Yeah, definitely more attractive compared to the year before for the Ford. Yeah. Yes, mm -hmm. absolutely. Yes.